Many cameras, especially DSLRs, output multiple video formats when using any external monitoring device such as the Zacuto EVF. These cameras may have additional information on the screen and the actual recordable image is shown relatively small. They may change the video format when you start recording and change it again when you play back your footage. Having all these different styles and outputs can make it very difficult to keep an ideal image size and placement in your monitor. The Zacuto EVF solves these problems with the use of its scaling features. The first option within the scaling menu is the Auto Playback option, which is the EVF's factory default setting. When this option is activated, the EVF will scale and format the image automatically by detecting the camera's output showing the entire uncropped signal including the recordable image and any visible camera settings that were turned on within the camera. This works with your camera in standby, record, and playback mode. Also within that scaling menu of the EVF you'll find camera presets. Within this menu are over a dozen accurate pre-scaled settings designed for specific cameras. These presets fill the screen of the EVF monitor with the largest recordable image possible. This option keeps the image scaled correctly when you're in standby mode and when you're recording. Just highlight the camera preset you'd like to use within the menu and hit the select button to choose that preset. If your image still isn't taking up the entire screen, there's a pretty good chance that you have to press the info button on your camera and get your camera in the correct mode. The Zacuto EVF also gives you the ability to manually adjust and save up to eight different scaling settings with the create user preset feature. Within each preset, you can decide how the EVF scales and positions the viewable image and frame lines via two boxes. The red box represents the active video area. In other words, it represents the outer edge of the EVF screen. For example, if your recordable image is positioned on the top right of the red box and your camera information is lined to the bottom and left side of the red box, then that is how it will be sized and positioned on the entire screen once saved and everything outside of the red box will be off of the EVF screen. You can select the preview option at any time to view the outcome of your current settings. The frame line parameter is represented by the green box. It's a 16 by 9 frame that will define where your frame lines will be generated. This allows you to customize the size and placement of your recording image and keep the frame lines consistent to that image. When you've completed all these manual adjustments, you're going to select Save User Preset. You'll be able to save a different configuration in each slot for a total of up to eight different presets. Now some cameras output a different signal when you push record. This may alter your manually adjusted image size and the image may be incorrectly scaled or positioned. To adjust for this, go ahead and open up the create user preset menu again while your camera is in record this time. Adjust the active video and frame lines again and save the settings into the same user preset that you created while the camera was in standby mode. The EVF will recall each preset instantly by recognizing which mode the camera is in. All the user presets you've saved can be found within the scaling menu in Recall User Preset. That's where you'll find all eight settings. Just highlight and choose your desired one to activate it. The Zacuto EVF was optimized to work with our specialized optical viewer, the Zacuto Z Finder. However, you can toggle on the overscan option, which maximizes the size of the viewable image on your EVF for use without a Z Finder. The Zacuto EVF also includes an option to correct a squeezed image when you're using anamorphic lenses or adapters. Just select from one of the three different anamorphic ratios, and when you do this, this will unsqueeze the image showing you the corrected shot. The anamorphic option can be found within the main menu. All of these options and many more are available with the Zacuto EVF right now. Just go to zacuto.com.